There's a safe. Is it open? Oh man. What up guys, I'm Little Sarge. Welcome back to another epic adventure. Now today I'm in a very risky, risky spot. I'm actually risking my life to be here. We are at an abandoned drug dealer's truck shop. This place is getting demolished because this used to be owned by drug dealers. Like hardcore drug dealers that would do all their drug business inside of this truck shop. It's closed down, the only way to get in is through here. Yeah, we found a way in. We've been There's a, a rainstorm outside, it is cold out. I got Carlo with me and I got Aldo with me right here. Um, their channel links will be down below. Um, you guys can go check him out, but right now we are making our way into this drug dealer's truck shop. The only way to get in it's through this beat up door. This place is getting demolished because a lot of drug activity was going on in this place. Dude, we're and get jumped here. Bro, there's only one way into this place. Yeah, one way out, it's through here. So I need you guys to take the biggest drug dealer that you know, smash his head on that like button. Let's get this video to at least 40,000 likes. You guys can do it. Sergeants, we're here. Let's get ready for the adventure. I regret not bringing my gloves with me on this one, but it's all good. Um, I'm gonna be the first one inside this creepy cavern. Okay. I'm stuck. Oh shit, I'm stuck my pants. Go ahead first. Gone wrong already, what happened? Dude, what if like, your leg just got chopped off right now? Oh shit. A table almost fell on my leg. Dude. Holy shit. I didn't even know it was in there. <laughs> Dude, this is the sketchiest entrance to a video I've ever seen. <laughs> it looks like we're already about to die. This is so bad. Well, oh, there goes my jeans. Oh, wow. Um. Well, he made it inside. Okay. Uh, I almost died. This table almost fell on my leg. It was leaning up against the door. Sorry, guys. The door doesn't open. Please. Yo, if we have to get out of here quickly, man, this is sketchy. Not only was this a drug dealer's truck stop, and they actually used to do their drug transactions here, but it was haunted. Guys, we gotta be quiet. We gotta be quiet. So it is late at nighttime right now, and this place is reportedly haunted. And People have actually died in this place because of obviously the drug dealers used to kill people here, which is why this place is um, closed down. And apparently, there's another truck stop that was owned by the same drug dealers up the road, and that one's been closed down too. With a house, we might literally go and film that one. Dude, what is this place? Bro, it's creepy in here. We might film that one later. Um, let me know if you guys want us to do, to do that video yeah, too. That was a camera. That used to be a camera. Shit, we're on the camera. No. That was a camera for the drug dealers? Yeah. What's in here? Oh, it doesn't open? like rooms where it's a truck stop guy peeing and a shower and chains and all that stuff. Yeah. Dude, I heard a lot of scary stories about truck stops. Like, people go yeah. Things, Look at this. Like, this is a shower. I know you guys like this spooky shit. This is a shower. That's cool. Hey, what's in here? Oh, yo. Yo, this might be where they used to hide their drugs. Come see. Where? Down there. Look, I found it was covered. It was covered by that. It might be where they used to hide their drugs in that hole. I don't know. If you were to hide drugs, where would you hide them? In a hole? True. True. Just like that? I need you guys. I need your support for this video, my friends. We are literally risking our lives being in here. Like, you never know if these drug dealers have money stashed here, if they have drugs stashed here, or if there's something really scary and haunted in here, like a ghost. And we might, like, we could literally get killed or get injured or seriously badly hurt being in here. This is scary. It is scary. We're gonna, we're in the basement right now. This is where we came in from. I don't know if that's good or bad. I don't know. I mean, we won't know if there's something here, but something here is definitely going to be weird. What's in here? Found a closet. 
Whoa, yo, two TVs? Cool, cool. Yeah. They probably used to hoard like steel TVs and shit. Probably just didn't know how to t get them out. I it's guarantee you they used to torture people in that in that chair. 100%. I guarantee you. Interrogation room right here? Y yes. Yo, this is probably the interrogation room. Come see this. This is the washer and dryer where they used to launder their money. Get it? Launder their Dude, money. Dude, I think like the hype part about the video is trying to get in from outside, but <laughs> yeah. it's raining. Today marks um, basically all the signs of something bad going wrong. We came out to a drug dealer's truck stop that's apparently haunted in the middle of a rainstorm. It is storming hella hard outside. We are literally near like a big you lake, know? like the beach right now. And yeah, there's a storm outside. It's very windy. As you can see, yeah, I'm wearing a jacket because it's super cold. Oh so this is the recipe for disaster coming in here alone three guys Pfft, Wish us luck man. Yo, I kid you not I kid you not they used to like torture people on these chairs here. That's what I'm told. That's a story at least Yeah Look, they got alarms. They got alarms on their doors. No, the alarms been cut. Now that we've explored downstairs, it's time to head upstairs and see what there is. It smells funky in here. It smells like poop. Smells very nice. Well, what do you expect from a freaking place that was run by a bunch of thugs, right? There's like a broken bathroom here. Just careful not to get caught. Do you guys want to see what it looks like outside? We're literally surrounded by mud. It's like no man's land outside. It was, uh, yeah, it's storming and we're stuck in here. And this is scary. This is very scary. So this was a legit uh, truck stop, but it was also used as a drug business, uh, money laundering business. There is so much to this place. <gasps> That's That scared me. Guys, keep your eyes wide open in case you spot anything. You never know, there might be something in here. An animal trying to escape. Why do I always decide to go alone in scary places? What's wrong? What's wrong? I don't know if you guys can hear that, but listen quietly. That noise outside is the storm. Um, there is a restaurant to the other side there. We're gonna go explore that soon. But I heard there was a safe here somewhere. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. <gasps> Dude, there it is. There's a safe, a blue safe, wow. That just stands out right there. There's a safe. Is it open? Oh man. I wish this thing, yo, there might even still be money in here since this is a drug dealer's truck shop. <sighs> there could be money in here somewhere. What is this? Oh, this is where they used to sell cigarettes. This is where they would keep their cigarettes. That's cool. Hey guys, I found the key. Did you? Yeah, but I don't know what it's for. Oh, get it, get it. That might be the key for the safe. I found the safe. Oh, you found the safe? Aldo said he found a key. Well, that might be the key for the safe. What is this place? It's a freaking truck stop. Wow, this is cool. Bro, this might be the drug dealer's safe. Check that out. Oh, what? You found a thing? Yeah. Oh my god. Try. I have the key. Should we try it? Yeah, try it on. Jesus. It looks that key looks bent to shit. Yeah. Here, here, try it. Safe, you guys? Huh? It's too rusty. Yeah. It seems like no, it's it's in. bent to shit. Yeah. I wonder if there's actually anything in there. That sucks. Carlo over here is telling me. But he has information that there might be a huge, a huge safe, you said? Yeah, there's a bigger safe in this place. Okay, so that little safe there, that's tiny. There's gotta be a bigger safe. I mean, come on. A bunch of drug dealers that own this place? Yo, they're gonna have a big safe, man. You know when I tell you guys, don't try this at home? This is one of those videos that you should never ever try because this, we have a huge risk of getting literally killed in here. We, might, we could die being in here. Like, we're taking a big risk. Although Carlo and I, we're really taking a big risk. Um, wish me luck, guys. I want you guys to do me a huge favor. Come to my Instagram, 
follow me on Instagram, turn on your notifications. Make sure you have notifications turned on for my videos as well on YouTube because you cannot see my videos on YouTube for some reason unless you have the notifications turned on. I need your support every time I upload a video. From the second I upload a video till the time it ends, I need you guys to watch these videos because I'm risking my neck for y'all, okay? I do this because I love you guys because I want to give you guys more and more entertaining videos. You don't see anybody out there putting the effort and the quality content that I'm putting. Like, I don't sleep, my friends. Like, I'm literally out there grinding and grinding and grinding and grinding just to get you guys some epic content and I really hope you guys see that and I really hope you appreciate that and yeah let's get back to the epic content yo is that an espresso machine I thought that was an espresso machine <laughs> bro I want an espresso so badly right now <laughs> this is so cool this is a restaurant wow hey I found money What's that? Where'd you find money? Look. It's change on the ground. It looks like somebody broke a jar that was full of change. Hey, maybe the safe is in there. Safe? Oh yeah, the safe. Where? You guys you guys are laughing at me. You guys yeah, it's just a spider web. These guys are laughing at me because there's a spider. Here, look. Hey Mr. Spider. Come here. Where'd he go? Oh, there it is. Here, oh, let's get it. Let's, come on, Mr. Spider. Oh, don't tell me I killed him. Mr. Spider. Mr. Spider. Oh, I killed Mr. Spider. I'm so oh, sorry. Guy, guys. guys, I killed Mr. Spider. <sighs> when I say I hurt, I hate hurting animals or any type of creature, I hate that. I love creatures. And I think it was already dead because the second I touched him, he fell. I think it was dead. It was probably frozen to the wall. What's in here? That's oh, kitchen. Oh, kitchen. Yo, that's a massive kitchen. Why? Okay, I'll be back to the kitchen. They, Carlo wants us to go this way. Has Carlo been here before? To your death? Whoa. What is that? That looks Oh my god. What? Yo, is this their office? It was right here. What's this? Dude. Yeah. Oh man, it's so safe. Somebody must have taken it. Dude, this is the drug dealer's office. So this is what a drug dealer's office looks like. This is very... <laughs> it is, look at this. There's like a little cash box. Okay, there's nothing in here. These guys were pretty organized for a bunch of thugs. Yeah, I should have thought there was a huge safe here. There was a safe? It's about this tall. Oh, so sorry guys. Sorry. The safe is no longer here. Apparently, yeah, this, this apparently it was right there in this corner. It's all good though. We shall continue exploring. This place is massive. I was actually surprised at how big this place is. The locker room. Do you guys hear that wind outside? Listen to that. That is how crazy the storm is outside. I don't even want to be stuck here tonight. Get out. The only way to get out is through that basement door that we came in from. Okay, so this looks like it was the kitchen. Yes, it was the kitchen and it is destroyed. Wow, what happened to this place? I know when it got raided by the cops, I don't think the cops would rip apart the ceiling like this. I mean, they were probably looking for drugs or something. I don't know, what the hell was that? Oh, you guys were there? Thought it was somebody else. Look at this. If you ever wanted to see behind the scenes of a truck stop kitchen. What's inside this fridge? Nothing. What if everything just came falling down on this other fridge here? What if there's a dead body in this freezer? Oh man, don't say that. Do you think the cops tore this place apart for looking for drugs or something? Probably did. Whoa. Possibly, huh? Been it looks like it's been raided, yeah, right? Yeah, it looks right. like something bad happened. And, and that's exactly what happened to this place. It got raided. It's crazy. And we are in the kitchen, the official kitchen. This is where they make your food. I mean, I would never trust a truck stop to make my food. Why not? Some truck stops are good. You think so? They're not hot. Is this a fridge? It's a fridge. Bro, they don't leave me any food, man. That sucks. Well, like yeah, a, hey, somebody's been eating jelly, jelly beans here. Really? 
Yeah, look. Somebody ate jelly beans. Very cherry jelly beans. Mm, I like cherry jelly beans. <laughs> How many of you guys have ever worked a dishwashing job? Let me know in the comments below. <laughs> this was, I worked this when I worked at McDonald's. A long time ago, I worked at McDonald's and I had to wash dishes. And it wasn't something I, I liked to do. So I water. I did that once at uh, Swishale. You did at Swishale? I did, I got like one week and I got promoted. <laughs> to what? To chicken cutter. Chicken cutter. <laughs> How do you have the kitchen? Man? This is a massive kitchen, I gotta say that. I've never seen a kitchen this big before. Like, it's massive. Did I go back to her yet? Well, I don't think I did. What's in here? Huh? Over there? Yeah. Yo. What is this? This is all the electricity. Tip box? What's in there? There's nothing in there. I don't know if I'm dumb or just crazy by being inside this room by myself right now. All the guys are out front. And I'm in here. Yo, listen to that. Dude, what the fuck is in here? Yo, there's something in here. Oh shit. Where are the guys? Oh my God, that just freaked me out. Whatever that was, it just really scared the crap out of me. Oh, there they are. Yo, I swear to God, I'm not joking. I heard footsteps back that way. Yeah, I was trying to take, I was trying to take a piss in the corner, and I heard footsteps over there. Not gonna lie, I just took a piss over there, yeah. and it was the scariest piss of my life. I swear to God, yeah, I was alone in here taking a piss. Ew! Somebody pooped on the ground. Why do people poop on the ground? Yo, guys, guys. Look, this thing's moving by itself. What? Look, it's moving by itself. What's moving by itself? Look, 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 in the corner. It's just moving, you see it? Not really. Look, come closer. Look at that. Are you talking that? Yeah. Oh, it was moving. Look, it's still moving, you can see it, look. It's shaking a little bit. Oh, I can kind of see it moving. But the weird part is not even really like moving, it's like swaying. It's just swaying. Yo, what the, I just felt something weird. That one too. I just felt something weird on my leg. Yo, I'm getting out of this washroom. Serious? This is the washroom. Something's happening in this washroom. I ain't, I ain't trying to wait around to find out what happened. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, look, 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 look. Look, it's moving again. Yo, I see it moving. Look at it. I see it It's moving. literally moving again. Yeah, yeah. Bro, this place is haunted. Yo. Dude. I don't know Bro, you know what's funny? You know what's funny? Every time I go somewhere haunted, those same things move. Look, those are moving too right now. Do you know who I in the washroom? Huh. Freddy. Freddy, fish, I'm out of here. Screw Freddy, I'm out of here. <laughs> I just took a pee in there. I just took the scariest pee of my life in there. Oh, <gasps> dead bird! Oh my god, there's a dead bird. Holy shit! Oh my god. There's a dead bird in here. That's a bad sign. That's a very bad sign. Bro, that's a bad omen right there. This is escalating very quickly. We need to find out here. Bro, how did we not see that dead bird before? I don't know, dude. What? Rest in peace, Mr. Bird. Okay, we are officially getting the hell out of here. Shotgun getting out first. Hello, you're last. Guys, comment if you're 420 friendly. <coughs> so, I'm going out first because I, I don't want to be in here last. I fucking my battery died. Shh, shh. Oh, man. Do you guys hear that storm outside? Yeah. Oh, no, no, I just get out. We are officially getting the heck out of here. I hope you guys enjoyed this um, little exploring adventure. There is a p another truck stop that's a sister truck stop to this one owned by the same drug dealers. Sister we, location? We might, yeah, we might go and explore it and do a second video. Let me know in the comments below if you guys want us to do a, a part two. And apparently there's a house to it as well, a drug dealer's house. So, drug dealer edition, guys. You never see this shit on YouTube. Smash that like button. Go subscribe to Aldo. Go subscribe to Urbex Carlo. Um, he's showing us a lot of good locations up here in Toronto. He's been a very good host since we've been up here. Um, I really appreciate all your support. I really appreciate everything, guys. You guys are awesome. And I want to keep bringing you guys good quality content just because you guys are so great. And I love you all from the bottom of my heart. On that note, don't forget, be you, do you, and just live a little and do not do what we're doing, okay? I'll see you guys later. Peace. Guys, before we came in here, we literally put a piece of wood at the top of that plank up there so nobody thinks that we're in here and it's gone. It's missing. Okay, let's go.
Okay, uh, maybe I'm not gonna end my video right now. <laughs> so this is the piece of wood I was telling you guys about. We had this sitting against the wall. The wind is pushing inwards. How would it fall backwards? You know what I mean? There's no way in hell. Somebody must have knocked that over. Yo, you guys good? Yeah, All right, let's go. I decided not to end the video yet. I just want to show you guys by risking my camera from getting water damage how crazy it is out here. It is super windy. There's a huge storm. Woo! It is cold. Canada is lit right now with cold, fam. Look at this. Look at that. I don't know if you. Shit, my camera is wet. I don't know if you guys can see this. But we are heading out of here through no man's land. And I don't really want to show outside because of all the rain. But take a look at that. We did all this for you guys. We did all this for you guys.